guys, this is Nara. Welcome back to my channel. Today's makeup is full peach makeup. I cut my bangs and changed my eyebrow shape. I used so many new makeup products today. I wanted to do uh, not too dark but not too light makeup so you can wear it every day in fall. If you're interested in this makeup, please keep watching. So before starting the makeup, I'm gonna apply a toner. This is I'm using this IOP Pore Set Mattifying Toner. I almost used it up so you cannot see it well, but I got it as a gift a month ago and I highly recommend it. It's hard to see, but there is powder under the toner, so before you use it, you have to mix it. I love it because it smells so good. It's like a fresh lemon. It's not oily at all because it has powder in it. It moisturizes my skin, but at the same time, it absorbs my oil. So I really like to apply it before I do a makeup. I recommended this Cosmos toner in the favorite video. And after that, I used it up. So I poured this eye toner in it and use this toner with a spray. They released this toner with this cleansing oil. They are in the same line that pour with that. But I'm not sure about this cleansing oil. It removes my makeup so well. And I really love the texture. It's a little thicker than other oils. But I don't know why it irritates my eyes so much. So when I use it, I have to use the eye remover first before using it. But I don't know if it's oil's problem or my eye's problem. But except for that, it's really good cleansing oil. After that, I'm gonna use 3C Cedar Wood Moisturizing Cream. It's also one of my favorite creams. Next, I'm gonna use Etude House Fix and Fix Toner Primer in the shade Rose. Next, I'm gonna use the 3C Cream Full Foundation with their brush. They release this foundation with this brush. It looks like a toothbrush. This foundation is very thick. So it has good coverage but not natural. There are some zits here and I'm gonna cover it with this. The one thing I don't like about it is that they release only one shade and it's way brighter than my skin. I want to recommend this brush more than the foundation. It's really easy to use and soft. I think it makes a foundation look better on the skin. This foundation is not dry, so for my skin, I have a combination skin, so my T-zone is very oily, and I need to use the powder for my T-zone. So I'm going to use this Pony Effect Mattifying Blur Powder. I'm gonna use Misha 201 brush. My face is much brighter than my skin, so I want to do contour and bronze my face first. I'm gonna use Pony Effect Contouring Master Palette and use this contouring powder. This is Innisfree Contouring Brush. They sent me their brushes and I really love them. These are really, really soft and they blend shadows, blushers, highlighters, everything very well. For my nose, I'm gonna use Misa 204 brush with the Edit House Ginger Milk Tea eyeshadow. For my eyes, first I'm gonna use this Pia number no. 8 eyeshadow with an Free Base eyeshadow brush. And then I'm gonna use I Mimi I'm Shadow Peony Coral with Innisfree Eyeshadow Brush Contouring. I'm applying it all over my eyes but not drag it too much. And then I'm gonna use 3C Triple Shadow Dainty Testy. Using Edit House 311 brush, I apply this the middle one right here.
and apply a little on the inner corner and then blend it with Misha tool for a brush next I'm gonna use the face shop brush pen liner black color After that, I'm gonna use this the darkest color in this triple eyeshadow using its free styling eyeshadow brush. I apply it right on the eyeliner. And then color my lashes. And I'm applying Edward House Mascara Fixer for a perfect lash. The fixer dries, so I'm gonna use this Vanilla Fox Tail Mascara. Today I'm gonna use lashes. This is Idol Lash Base number no. 5 Daily from Aritao. I'm gonna draw fake on the lashes with the, the Face Shop Brush Pen Liner Ink Brown color. I'm gonna draw my eyebrows. I changed the shape. It was much straighter before. I cut the bottom and then made it rounder. I'm gonna use Eddie House Drawing Eyebrow number two, gray brown color. And now I'm using Eye Mimi Eyebrow Cara in the shade Dark Brown. Now I'm going to show you a new blusher and highlighter from Misha. It's so pretty. They are pretty expensive, around $20, but they are so pretty. This one is Misha Setting Blusher Peach Avenue, and this one is Misha Setting Highlighter Touch of Light. I'm gonna use Innisfree Blusher Brush. It's not powdery and very natural. The color is so pretty. And then I'm gonna use this Touch of Light using this Innisfree Highlighter Brush. I'm not sure about this highlighter. It's very gold. See, it's not natural. It's very gold white color and very strong, not natural, and not smooth. But if you are looking for a natural and subtle highlighter, it's not, it's too strong. For my lips, I'm gonna use this Wake Make lipstick in the shade number 7, Rose in the Trap. It's my first time using it. It feels so good when I use the new product. It's very matte but very soft. It's Misha 306 brush. I just did my hair and came back. I cut my bang 30 minutes ago. I just wanted to. So I cut it in the bathroom. So today's makeup is done. Thank you for watching today. I hope you have or had a wonderful day today. Please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching today. 
See you in my next video.